hard to explain if you're not in athletics, but this is no simple feat. And it's just unbelievable every time I look at the list. Auburn, Florida, Florida International, MTSU, Ole Miss, Ohio State, Vanderbilt, Virginia, Virginia Tech, Wake Forest, Western Kentucky, and Tennessee. You know, that is an unbelievable accomplishment. But before I have him come up and do his intent, I, the couple of words I wanted to say is has nothing to do with basketball. Nothing. I watched this young man come in as a freshman that was, I don't know if he's really going down the right path. We talk about this all the time. But what he's accomplished in those four years and the interactions that he's had with all of you guys, his classmates, I've never once seen him be it a middle school student, be it an upper school student, just ignore them and man, I ain't got time for y'all and just keep walking. He always has time for everybody. And, and this is not only a great honor for him, but this is a great honor for our school. I mean, Keon has given us an opportunity to put Webb on the map in a lot of different ways that maybe we don't get. And these, these times that we have an individual like this, we need to cherish it and, and, and be glad we have that opportunity. And especially when they turn out to be what Webb is all about, character, home, all the things that we talk about all the time up here, you hear different people talk about, he emulates every bit of it. So I'm excited to see today that he'll sign his letter of intent to attend the University of Tennessee this next fall to play basketball and to also work on his college education. So it's exciting to see that. So, Keon, I know you want to say a, a word here, and if the Johnson family and coaches would come on up, we'll, we'll do this presentation here. Thank you. 